Good morning and welcome to Day My Life. That was so weird. Um, I just love these videos and it's my first day back in Leeds today. So I've got some like stuff to do. It's quite boring stuff, but I figured I'd just take you along with me. I literally, I woke up like 20 minutes ago, I just went to sign bed. Um, it's 20 past 11. <sighs> so I mean, you see those people on YouTube that like, yeah, so I wake up at like 8. Not here. Not here. Um, but I'm just going to do some like stuff. Now I'm going to do some stretching because it's one of the new resolutions. Drink some water and then I'll go get like breakfast and stuff. Um, the plan for today is I need to do a food shop. Because I have nothing in. Um, I went and got some milk yesterday, so I'm gonna have porridge for breakfast. What else I need to do? I need to finish putting my clothes away because I've got like a bin there that's like full of clothes I need to put away um, and film this. And go to the gym probably. I do want to go to the gym today, but yeah. I'm gonna do some stretching now. Um, I'm gonna put a YouTube video on because I don't really know what I'm doing. Yeah, also, I have not made my bed yet, if you could not tell. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think I've done this for a week, but anyway, I'm gonna do some stretching. I got a yoga mat for Christmas. Um, I didn't have a time off my walk over Christmas, but I do now, so yeah. I just try and follow this like stretch video, but they're really weird stretches. And like, I know how to stretch. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> I'm a dancer, I stretch all the time. Um, so I'm just sort of gonna do my own thing. <laughs> Does anyone else find with reusable coffee pots it makes really watery coffee? Like I feel like I'm gonna have to start using Oh it's just from yesterday. I feel like I'm gonna have to start using my cafe tea hair, which I don't even know where it is because I can't deal with the watery coffee but it doesn't really fit under the thing, so I'm just going to grab another cup. Like, what's that? That's just water. But I've googled the issue and I, it just doesn't, I don't know how to fix it. So, I don't know. Like, I've packed it tight. Let me google it again. It just says to press it more, but I've tried that. Let me, right. Maybe now it's watery. I might be able to press it a bit more, but this is going to make a mess. Attempt number two. We're getting a social dog, by the way. I'm going to try in like smaller bits and then press it like a lot. Like as much as I can. It started off okay. It's now got watery again. Less watery, but still very watery. This is basically just straight water. <sighs> I give up. Anyway, let's give it a quick taste test and then I'm going to make my porridge. Pretty good colour. So good. Oh, it's beautiful. What the fuck? I don't usually like coffees as strong as well. It's a medium rice, velvety, sweet, gorgeous. But I'm gonna Google some better like coffee, reusable coffee pods because I'm getting really pissed off about it. Anyway, I'm gonna make my porridge now. Um, you know when you see it because it's pretty self-explanatory. I just, oats, milk. I'd put bananas in if I had it, but I don't. And I'm gonna steal someone's maple syrup, I think. Here is my porridge. It's not a lot um, because I never finished my porridge. So I figured I'd make a small portion and I didn't want it to overflow. So I'm gonna sit, I'm gonna eat this, drink the rest of my coffee and research these little coffee pods and then I'll 
I'll see you after when I'm doing something else. I think I'll probably get dressed. Okay, so because I'm going to the gym later, I'm not going to put any makeup on. And I'm not going to have a shower yet. Um, I will, obviously, after the gym. But my hair is very greasy. Um, I really change up how much I wash my hair. Like, sometimes it's, like, once a week and sometimes it's, like, every two days. It just sort of depends on what I'm doing. Um, and if I can be bothered because... I put so much effort into washing my hair, so obviously it looks very, very greasy and it feels disgusting. Um, so I'm just going to dry shampoo it and put it back. Um, I'm going to go do my food shop after this. I wrote like a... I wrote like a general um, food shop list a few months ago. Um, just before I went home about sort of what things I want to get like every shop what things I might treat myself to um, just like stuff like that because I get so overwhelmed going shopping for obvious reasons um, so yeah I'm quite excited to see how this goes my only thing is I hate looking at lists while I'm shopping I don't know what it is I just don't like it um, so yeah, I'm gonna take you in the car with me because I've got my little car tripod now. Um, got a message, gonna be ready. Yeah. Um, yeah. I'm just gonna put my hair back. Honestly, I've been so looking forward to the gym, and now the day's like actually here that I can go because I couldn't really go over Christmas because I was working. But now the day's come where it's like I need to get into a routine of going to the gym. It's, Kind of scary. Um, even though I like my gym, I'm gonna put my AirPods on charge before I go shopping as well because they're low battery, and obviously I need them. So just my everyday clip, which looks stupid. I sort of just mess around with where I place this on my hair. We'll go with that today. Okay, I'm gonna get dressed and put some like just some moisturizer on. Um, because you should moisturise every morning. Oh, I should show you. Do you know what? If you want an update on the mini fridge, if you don't follow me on Instagram, you should. I did post a picture of it yesterday. Um, I'm going to get some Diet Cokes to put in here as well. But here is my mini fridge. It's just my mini fridge. got all my skincare in it. I know it looks silly having my cellar water in there. But honestly, I used my cellar water yesterday because... I was feeling lazy um, and I was tired because I'd been like moving all day. Um, so I used my, my cellar water yesterday, obviously after it had been chilled. So nice, so nice. Um, obviously my gua sha's in there as well. Anyway, just get to use this. I'm really unsure on this moisturizer. I don't know if it's thick enough for me. I might have to get another one as well, but um, just based on my budget this week, I can't afford it. And it's not that necessary. Like, if it was a need, then obviously I would. Like, my coffee pods are a need. Um, which is why I spent 30 quid on them. Um, after a horrendous amount of research. I only got one as well. But I figure my other ones were like 15 for three. And they're really not good. So, hopefully these will be good. And they're like, sold by a coffee company as well. Um, so I trust them a lot more. Um, yeah, just put my moisturiser on. Um, I do want to put more stuff in here, obviously. I'm going to put my Diet Cokes in here, as I've said. But I need to go buy them. But first, I need to decide what I'm wearing. So, shall I? You know what? You're going to have to decide what to wear today. It's not going to be that interesting, because... Um, I mean, I'm just going shopping. Like, it's not going to be my all-day fit, because I'm going to get changed for the gym. I might even put like my gym leggings on, so I just have to change my top. Yeah, I'm gonna do that, otherwise I just won't go. <laughs> this is the very uninteresting shopping fit. Let me view you'll see me. Let me leave you. I'm got these socks on. I'm literally just gonna wear like Air Force. Like, I don't matter what shoes I'm wearing, I'm doing a food shop. Um yeah, I've got my let me just step back. Got my Tyler Skin Lux leggings on, they're my favourites obviously. Um not the flares though. Just wasn't feeling them today. 
And I just got this top from ASOS and I actually have a bra on because when I'm doing like tasks I like to have chest support. Um, which is something I've learned to accept because I literally never wore And then I've just tucked it in because it looked a bit ugly otherwise. Um, yeah, just gonna finish off with some perfume and then we'll go to the shop and talk you through what I'm gonna buy in the car. Oh, signature scent, you know. If you're wondering what my signature scent is, it's Chance by Chanel. There's not a chance I'm getting decent lighting in here. Um, but I've sorted out my car mount. Honestly, she seems quite good so far, but I'm gonna drive with my car, my camera on it. Um, if you can see the set of my back window or literally any of my car, I'm aware it needs to clean. Um, it's one of tomorrow's jobs, I think. See, this is the awkward thing. Like, I'm just not confident to vlog properly. I'm like, there's no way of hiding my cameras filming right now. I think it's very obvious. Um, but honestly, who cares? I don't know why I have a mask on. I just put it on my face because I couldn't carry it. Anyway, as I said, I have like a list on my phone of like things I buy weekly and then other things I need. The issue is it's the same Aldi that every single student goes to. So whether they have everything in stock is the right question because I do have quite a basic taste in food. Um, i.e. I absolutely bum spinach and avocado. But we'll see how it goes. I'm gonna get myself some veggie meat as well. Aldi's not even that far away. I'm so glad I can go to Aldi though because the shops within walking distance are extortionate. Which, honestly, if that doesn't like sum up exploitation, like students were known for being broke. And yeah, we get given the most expensive shops in our area, and it's every student area as well. Because I know that the one in Newcastle student area, Jesmond, has is the highest markup Sainsbury's in the country. So that's really interesting. I am severely unsure as well. I just spent that much money in Aldi. Like I have no food. In that I understand, but in Aldi is so ridiculous. Um, my car is such a mess, I can't even touch it without getting dirt all over my hands, like it's disgusting. So, definitely gonna go get a clean tomorrow, but I don't, I might go after the gym today. It's sort of on my way back. Um, but we will see. I got a lot of like, I got a lot of stuff, I just got basically everything I wanted to. Which is probably why it's so much. Um, but it wasn't even that much more than I usually get, I don't think. Like, it was a bit more. Oh, I feel really awkward because I know, like, my screen is fake. Like, my screen isn't up. Um, because, I don't know, I feel like that's kind of bad. What the fuck are you being for me? Um, I don't know, I feel like I get distracted if the screen is there. So... So, um, so I've put it down, right, I'm actually just, can't speak it right. Basically, I feel really awkward because my screen is like facing outways. So like, if you look at my car, you can see my screen filming me. And like, I wear, I'm aware you can see me as well. Um, but it just feels weird that people can see my screen. I don't know, because I can't, because I've got it put at the back. So they, they had behind bean snap pots on special buys and I'm so happy about it because they're so much easier and they're such like a perfect portion for me and I just, I'm just so happy about it. Um, yeah, my car is so, like, that's disgusting. 
Anyway, yeah, I'm gonna go and pack my food. Um, I have lunch yet? Nah, I'm just not really hungry yet. Um, maybe clean the bathroom. I don't know. I don't want to wait too long before going to the gym because otherwise I'm gonna end up going at like five. Right, I should just go to the gym now. I'll unpack my stuff and then we'll have a protein bar and go to the gym. because the roads are so tiny and annoying and you have to change lanes every 30 seconds. So most people just have a death wish and like, just aren't even asked. Like, and I lose attention to the train time. On my drive home yesterday, literally lost my attention for that like 0 0.2 of a second. I was got undertaken really bad on the motorway, which was weird because there was literally no reason for it. Um, I'm like, I hate people on the motorway, it really pisses me off. And like every time I try, every time I drive down, I try and like notice if there's any patterns around certain areas, but there's not. Everyone is just shit. I've decided I am actually gonna give you a little haul of what I got. Um, just cause why not? Why not? I don't know what kind of things I'm eating at the moment. As I said, my high snack pots. Um, some fiber bars, I've got some other ones in here as well. Some salmon fish cakes. Some wraps, I love a good wrap. Um, two bags of lentil crisps because they last a while and they're good snacks. So obviously I might as well just get them both. And I, because I fancy them both a lot of the time. Um, last thing is why we just peppers. I love peppers, I put them in everything. Oh, and a protein bar that I'm gonna have in a bit. And bathroom cleaner. Um, one of my bags actually ripped. I was getting it out of the car, so that was fun. Big catch up because we all use ketchup a lot and it makes sense. Butter, I didn't have any. I literally had my last one for years as well. Baby spinach, again, I put spinach on fucking everything. Bagels, mostly for breakfast. Tomatoes, one, a good snack, two, I like them like in with cheese sandwiches. I don't know. I just thought I'd get them. Whether I'd eat them all, I don't know. Um, shredded cheese. I was gonna get the vegan cheese, however, I thought, you know, treat myself. Um, honey, because I steal everyone else's. Chopped tomatoes, because you just need some chopped tomatoes in your cupboard, don't you? If you don't have any, you need to go buy some. Cucumber, lettuce, I don't have any room to take a look out. Spinach and ricotta tortellini, lamb coriander rice, just because it's a good side for like, you need some rice. Honey, let me put this all away and then I'll come back and show you the rest, because there's still one more bag. And it's the ripped one, so. Okay, part two. Avocados, obviously. Bananas, because I like to have them on my porridge. I was going to get some frozen fruit as well, but I figure, no. I'll get that if I fancy it. We don't have a lot of room in our freezer, so. Onions, again, because you need onions. Pasta, which I'm realising I now actually have more pasta than I thought. Shut up. Thank you. Eggs, because eggs. Why am I saying because? Like it's food. Because food. More pasta. Cheese spread again, put on bagels, literally. I love cheese spread. I got some, oh, these are the best, th these in wraps with spinach, mayo, cucumber. It's literally beautiful. Um, so yeah, I got some of these. These are literally my favorite things they have been for a while. Um, so vegan chicken nuggets. This little katsu curry pot thing. Um, it's honestly just an easy dinner and it tastes really good. I don't really like the other ones. I tried the hoisin one, I didn't like it. Um, some more fiber bars. And then I've got some cherry yogurt and some tomato mascarpone pasta. 
sauce and that is everything I got which I wear is it is a lot I bought a lot of stuff I think I don't know I don't have a concept but a lot of it is sort of long lasting I guess okay quick pitch up before the gym I'm not going to take you because there's no point I wouldn't take you into the gym anyway um I've just got Tyler Skin Lux oh and I've said this before Tyler Skin at the top I don't remember what the top's called but it's great it's got like a built in bra um this is just a Primark hoodie um I just don't really like my arms so I don't have them out and then I've got my lasers on honestly I need to get some other ones because I don't really like wearing these to the gym first of all I'm actually wearing them to the gym I usually just wear like sports shoes but because I'm doing like squatting and stuff it's better to have the ankle support so yeah I'm gonna go in a bit I'm just having a diet coke first I put my diet cokes in my mini fridge now um just because I'm kind of tired mm. so I need to get some energy before I go anyway yeah quick good check I quite like this that combo that's going on but yeah I'm dead my legs are like they're not like jelly jelly they're like semi jelly you know like it's it's the jelly's not fully set yet but like you could eat it if in your if you're on a short time span anyway sort of session <laughs> the gym makes me so anxious I'm not gonna lie I just feel like I look like I don't know what I'm doing that's probably because I'm chubby and I'm a woman anyway I really need to get in the shower now I'm so tired I might go grab a quick snack but I haven't had lunch it's like 10 to 5 I think I'm gonna go make a wrap and then I'll eat the wrap and then I'll get in the shower it's just annoying cause, oh, I'm just gonna leave my hair to air dry I mean I've got time I don't need to blow dry it and then I'll just dry it tomorrow um it's just so much it looks so much nicer when I blow dry it but I really don't want to so here we are right I'm out the shower obviously um I forgot to film what I ate and what and like my shower but I feel like I've done I think I've said in a day in life before what my shower like routine is but yeah I'm just like in let me I'm just in like joggers and a top because I'm not really doing anything the rest of the day I don't think um this is not great lighting so I'm just sort of gonna chill out and there's no point in me putting like clothes on for that um these joggers are like the best thing ever by the way let me put you let me show you them properly so they're apartment pants Levi's if you didn't know I literally worked there until two days ago <laughs> um they're literally the best thing ever, especially if you're short. I wouldn't get them if you're over like five, 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 six, probably. Um, just because they hit like perfectly on my ankle. Then I also do have quite high hips, so you know. Anyway, these are the best things ever, and I'm wearing them all the time. And I literally wore them every day to work anyway, even though Levi's is a jean shop. <laughs> um, my top is ASOS. I look grim. I'm not going to be able to dry my hair because. I can't be asked, and I've also noticed that I'm having a bit of a bloaty day and I was thinking oh why is that and then I remembered how much I ate last night um so that would be why but yeah I'm really impressed with myself that I can actually sit like this right now because I thought my camera was downstairs a second ago and I was like I'm not going back down to get it um but it was on my bed so you know anyway I'm just gonna chill now I don't really want to do with myself I had I've got to say I had a wrap just before I got in the shower. But I forgot to take my camera off this. Um, it was just those chicken tikka pieces. Um, they're high in protein by the way. Spinach, high in protein if you didn't know. And then some mayo and some cheese, just in a wrap. Uh, I've made it before. For some reason it was nicer before, I don't know. But it's still pretty good. Um, yeah, I'm gonna wait for a while to have then obviously when I get hungry again. Um, so that I get hungry quite often, so we'll see when that is, but. Yeah, my leg has started to hurt now. Um, I've posted a TikTok of like my post gym pump if you're interested because it was leg day. Um, this seems to be doing quite well as well, which 
videos on my body you get a lot of shit and this one hasn't yet so we will see what happens anyway i'm just gonna sit do nothing for a while probably till lot gets back because i don't really have anything else to do right it's still relatively early i'm so worried about spilling this um it's like seven o'clock i think but i was really hungry and it was making me anxious so i made myself a fat bowl of pasta honestly i just wanted the carbs it's got so much cheese in it it's literally i've got it's spinach and ricotta tag the the, pa, pa, the pa, parcel things what they're called I don't know, i've always called them pasta packets but no one knows what that is um with tomato mask and sauce and then more cheddar on top no regrets it's beautiful i'm gonna eat this i think i'm gonna watch a film i might turn my lights down put a candle on just because anxiety flare up so i want to you know chill out for a bit um i'm just gonna watch from brooklyn 99 i think yeah i literally always i feel like every daily vlog i do where i have like some kind of flare up um i couldn't really tell you why my anxiety's on one i've got just got my amethyst with me um i don't really know why this has happened um i think i just let myself get too hungry sort of stresses me out when I do that and I can't really tell you why I'm also waiting for a reply to a text um which is such like a small thing um and I'm getting I'm anxious because I'm bored do you know what I mean like that I feel like that's like my brain's sort of default um but I also don't really have the energy to do anything nor do I want to um but it's too early to get to bed so I just don't really know what to do um so i just thought i'd talk because i don't know i don't know i don't know it's just something to do in it i could meditate but i need to start meditating more i'm really like i'm not doing it at the moment it's, sometimes I do it when I feel like I need to like reconnect with the world a bit, like if I feel a bit spaced out, um, I try and do it to like re, not centre myself, like re, I don't know, it's like I'm, it shows like a wider picture in my head, I can't describe it like I just sort of replace myself in the world, um, I, sh I don't know what I'm doing. I'm stressing and I have to be fair I've got quite a few like stressful things going on right now like I'm waiting to hear back from a job that I really 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 want um and it's Mercury retrograde and I don't know I'm just stressing out and I don't really know what to do about it I don't feel very well either. I already felt like a bit bleh before I ate. Um, eating that much cheese is probably not a great idea. But obviously, um, even talking about food is a bit of a difficult one for me, especially when like I've eaten something that's not typically like healthy and I post it, I feel I get a lot of anxiety about that. Um, and I think I've done quite a few challenging things so I was saying this earlier like um obviously with my body issues and my eating disorder and stuff i struggle sometimes um doing certain things that like sort of put focus on your body so obviously i did a food shop today um which i hate doing um and it's not that I hate buying food, it's that I hate other people being in there. Because, like, I remember I was walking around and I was just thinking everyone's looking at my trolley, everyone's judging what I've got in it, stuff like that. And then obviously going to the gym, 
is difficult because I just I feel like I don't know what I'm doing. I feel like I look like I don't know what I'm doing, and everyone's just looking at me like, why is she even trying? And I know it's like a silly mindset to have. Like I say, it's silly, but like it is like mental health issues. It's just draining, trying to combat a lot of things in one day, um, and then finishing off with pasta. I love pasta, but like I don't know. It's just struggling and i'm trying not to think about how many calories have been this is sort of just life without uni at the moment isn't it like i i, I get it's a good thing that i'm bored because usually i would be so drained by this point that the thought of doing literally anything other than sitting and watching something i'd watched a hundred times would be painful um just not my name um but it's still really frustrating being like this because it's like, I, okay, so I, usually when I'm like this, I want to film, like, content and stuff, but I don't feel pretty. And obviously I don't want to really sit in front of, <laughs> I've realised it's so funny, I'm saying this as I'm playing in front of the camera. I don't really want to film content and, like, film myself when I feel like this. Um, so it's a bit of a rough one. I don't really have like, anyone to speak to right now, because the one person that I speak to, like, all times at work. Um, so I just keep going on my phone, realising there's literally nothing there. And that's why this text is making me so anxious. And I don't really know who else to speak to. Yeah, I just don't really know what to do. And it stresses me out. I've literally said that so many times now. Hi, I am burning my one customer young candle, which is one of my favourite Christmas presents. Again, wasn't even what I got for Christmas because I hadn't got it yet. But so good. It smells amazing. I love the smell of the dryer um, and it sort of smells like that but like fancier, there's no really other way to put it, so I really like it. I now mostly chilled, um, it's like, what time is it? It's been a fair few hours, I'm watching Gilmore Girls in bed, it's 10 o'clock, what? <laughs> um, I don't know, I feel alright now. This candle is such a beautiful thing. Um, I'm going to start getting ready for bed relatively soon, but I don't know when exactly. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just sort of chilling, so I thought I'd update you. Um, did some, oh, I did some journaling. Also, can I just say, I'm so lucky because of the waves in my hair, like the way my hair naturally is. Um, like my hair dries like naturally like this, which is great, but it's still not how I like it. So I will fix it tomorrow with heat colours. But yeah, I love this colour of LED light, right? Because it just I feel like it makes me look the nicest. Um, yeah, I'm just watching Gilmore Girls in bed. I'm really not doing anything. Anyway, um, I honestly feel like tomorrow probably would have been a more interesting day to film i'm going to get my nails done so if you want to see them they'll be on my instagram uh yeah my i don't know gonna get my nails done i'm gonna read tomorrow that's on my list what else was i gonna do clean the bathroom didn't do that today yeah i'm just sat in bed and i've realized i have some of this left downstairs i was really craving something like chocolatey and then my friend posted a picture of waffles on her story and I was like, pain. I had a fiber bar and that sort of subsided now. So, yeah. I am um, just gonna probably just chill for the rest of the night. Like, I know that's what I've been doing. I might, no, I don't really feel like doing a face mask. I feel like that would go with the vibe better tomorrow. You know, like if I'm getting my nails done, doing a face mask. I might fake tan because I've got a party this weekend, so I might do that at some point this week. And then I'm seeing someone someday, so um uh, I don't know. Maybe, maybe. I do like myself with the tan, but I don't mind myself pale and I'm really lazy, so I can't really be asked. You can tell I'm in such a better mood now. Um my amethyst has just been sitting on my bed. I realised how many crystals help with anxiety though, like when I was looking through them, like amethyst helps, um, another one I've got, like, what's it called, it's like ta 
Talos is uh, how do I pronounce it? Literally. Lapis lazuli. I really want to get a tiger's eye. I feel like a lot of people really like tiger's eyes and I don't have one. Maybe again I'll do that tomorrow. I don't know. I'm going to try to get like take some new content for like TikTok and Instagram tomorrow because I'm hoping I feel a bit more pretty. Saying that I don't have passive for dinner so I might still be quite bloaty. But we will see. I feel really great that I'm like showered and clean and I've got clean hair. I love having clean hair. But yeah. I'm just rambling again. This is why my vlogs are always so long. Like, why my videos are so long. Because I just don't shut up. I forgot to finish the video yesterday. Here we are. Um, I literally just ended up in bed for the rest of the night. Just chilling on FaceTime. Do I ever. So, it wasn't that interesting. Um, anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I'm not sure if it was too interesting. As I said, today would probably have been a better day to film because I'm going to get my nails done. But, get a little bit of insight into my life. And as I said, I do love daily vlogs. So, yeah. Um, if you did enjoy, subscribe, obviously. Follow my TikToks, my Instagram. I'll see you next week. Bye.